Howdy YouTube, and welcome to Before You Buy Reviews. On the back of your Mac Mini, you're going to have an HDMI port as well as a Thunderbolt port. We're going to use both of these to connect two monitors. To set up the initial monitor, in this case my TV, use your HDMI from the TV and place it into the HDMI port. Let's call this monitor 1. Now once you have that connected, let's make sure the monitor works. Turning on monitor 1, you'll see the display load correctly and everything will look as per normal using one monitor. Now we have our second monitor and to use this we're going to use a mini display port to HDMI adapter from Mashi. This will connect to my Thunderbolt port on the back of my Mac mini and enable me to connect my second display via HDMI. This is a great handy adapter. You can pick it up in any Apple store. It was roughly about $29 to $35 range. On the back of your Mac Mini, you'll see the Thunderbolt. Connect your second display HDMI cable to your adapter firmly, and then connect your DisplayPort adapter to the back of your Mac Mini. It's okay if your Mac Mini is on at this point, and also the second monitor must be powered on as well. Upon doing so, you'll immediately see displays showcasing on both systems, on both monitors. Now once you have that connected, you want to go to your system settings on your Mac Mini. And in there, you can change the arrangement of the displays. Right now, I'm going to switch them to be mirroring, so we have the exact same picture on both displays. To better showcase this, what I'll do is I'll change the background wallpaper so that we can see the simultaneous picture on both displays. Now in some instances you may want to have two displays that work together as one unit. So you turn off mirroring displays and then you can drag applications from one screen to the other. I hope that this video is helpful. If you have any questions leave them below in the comments and otherwise thanks for watching and kindly subscribe and like my videos.